All right, welcome back to Southern Cross Station. This is episode two. As you can tell, I'm a true farmer because I'm outstanding in my field. Okay, I seen that uh, on a t-shirt somewhere and I, I had to make the dump. So, hopefully you appreciate my bad jokes, but if you don't, you know, that's okay. I, I'm full of bad jokes and uh, I do apologize if you don't like them, but uh, I'm not going to give up anytime soon. So we're going to do the canola today, as you can obviously see we're already doing, but uh, I'm hopefully we're going to get my, I'm trying to get my cruise control to work. There we go. Anyway, uh, I did have to turn a couple things, uh, changed a couple things. Uh, right now we are on easy economy. If we start getting to the point where it's just getting to be way too easy, we're going to change it. But, uh, you know, it's not survival, so we're not going to try hard or anything. But uh, we may go to medium if need be. Uh, I did also shut off, uh, you know, uh, crop damage so that is off uh, we're gonna leave traffic on for now I I just I I kind of detest traffic but uh, I've been watching quite a few other youtubers trying to get ideas you know of what I'm doing wrong and uh, this one is actually being recorded like an hour after I ended the other one so uh, I've been out watch you know watching people's uh, YouTube channels and kind of getting ideas of what I should do. It's been so long, you know, like I said, I've been on YouTube that I'm still new to it. Uh, by now, the first video obviously should have been out, and uh, there should actually be a second, another video out, one if not two, for uh, Hydroneer. I do have a ton of other games that I like and uh, we're probably going to do some of them and those are not going to be uh, scheduled they're going to just be you know I'm going to do them see what people say type of thing and if they like them I mean I'm probably going to do like five six episodes each and then just wait and see what people have to say you know those are it's going to be stuff that's actually going to be done we're not just going to, uh, you know, make one video and say, well, if you like this, I'll make more. No, I don't want to do that. Um, but I, I hope you guys do like my videos. I've been working hard on them. I'm trying to uh, improve myself. I've been really trying to fight the errs and ahs and ums. A little bit hard, I guess, you know, when it's your natural speech, it's really easy to do it. But I've noticed if I sit here and I think, okay, I can't say those words, I can keep myself from doing it. Uh, what was the other? We were going to check on uh, some other things here in a bit, but we'll do that when we're, uh, after we're done with the first time of filling uh, everything, so... But I, I did play with the the, thing, the the tube a little bit. It It's really picky. You got to get it just right, you know, so it's fine. Maybe we'll just, uh, you know, fight with it. Or maybe there's a way to add the, you know, the, what do you call it? The, the, gr the grid underneath it, you know, just to load directly in. If not, then we'll probably have to remove it and put uh, one in there. Which is fine. I mean, I really don't want to just delete something that somebody put their hard time into making and designing. Say, hey, we're going to give you this fun stuff to work with, you know. You know, maybe what we'll do is we'll keep it. And as we work our way across to some of the other fields, we'll put another silo in over there to, to do that type of stuff. So, you yeah. know, we'll definitely see what's going to happen with all that stuff. But I think once we get on this, uh, back on the straight and narrow here to go, I'm going to run a time lapse quick. And hopefully we can, uh, 
think I can see already we're gonna fill up the thing we're only one lap around and we're already right close to fifty percent, which is fine. I mean the more the more we fill up, the more money we're gonna have in the long run. So that's definitely a good thing. I did notice we do not have a planter or anything, or maybe I'm just missing it. But we're gonna have to look into that before we can even think of doing uh, straw. But let's get on with the time lapse and uh, go from there.
ีอย่างเงี้ยโอเคโซโอเคไปดูแลไรต์เดอร์It says stop on loading, so we should be ready to load now. I just saw my marker too. There we go. So yeah, it looks like we can, as a normal, you know, silo, we can. Uh, Go ahead and turn that on the back one now. But I think we're gonna do a single. We're gonna get a single hopper at some point. I mean, we're not gonna get rid of this. This thing is extremely useful for when we do smaller fields. And let's see what's going on here. Oh, it is unloading. Okay, it's showing that we're unloading. I wonder if we uh, bumped it a little bit too much. And... Oh, let's see. Let's stop unloading, so it should be okay. I don't know what the deal is here. Let's see if that fixes it at all. I don't see it going in up there. Look, it gets me. Are we not done? Uh... Yeah, we have to be on the back one. Six. All right. Okay, for whatever reason. Yeah, we're not. Uh... Well, see, it shows that we're unloading, but, uh... See, whatever is going on here, this thing keeps moving just a little bit. There we go. I wonder if maybe they make a better one that's got a better uh, unit where it's meant to actually be drove over the top of.
cool. <laughs> this may be one of those things that we uh, kind of uh, come over and drop it off and call it good, you know, off, off screen type of thing. But we'll see what happens. So like I was saying, in this big field out here, we can kill all the trees, some of the trees out here. Not all of them, just some of them, like probably the this one here and a couple others that are closer to the center of the field. But for right now, let's go ahead and park this thing. Let's go purchase. Anything else has got... I mean, we could afford this and use it, but I don't think we really need it. That's the thing. You know, I'd like to have this, but I don't need it. Let's go into our garage, see cultivators. We do not have, we have no type of planter or seeder. Let's see, how much horsepower is the John Deere? 175. So we can get a planter, or seeder, I mean, that can handle at least 125, 175. That's 210. I got a bad feeling about this. Actually, how big is our uh, our big tractor? Three hundred and seventy-five horsepower. So let's actually just buy a unit that's made for that. So that can handle it. Well, we don't have enough money for any of those. We'd have to buy. Either way, we'd have to buy that which then we need that for it. And I'm not sure if that can fit on the big tractor or not. I think it can. Let's just go ahead and we'll, uh, well, we need a rock picker too. That's part of the problem. I mean, we may have to go with this. So uh, if we go rock picker, kind of want this one so we don't have to fight with it. Back. Let's go ahead and grab this one and pick around. I mean, worst comes to worst, we can lease something to, uh, to plant the field. In fact, we could we could really do that. Um, but we're going to get the stone. We got the stone picker. We got 48,000, but you know, we could even uh, lease a, uh, a baler to do the baling as well. So what I want to do is, oh, we do have a kind of trailer, don't we? Actually, let's bring, bring this guy in and put him in the shed. That's the only thing I miss about the uh, 19 is you could, uh, you jumped out of your tractor back to it, they kept your distance that you had from the Or at least I think it did. That's where I remember that. Like I said, even if they hear the lawnmower going by for a little bit here and there, so I do apologize for it, but like I said, it's Oh, I thought maybe that was a weight sitting there or something. Here's grass growing up. Or, uh, okay. Lower that. So I really don't want to drive this thing over. And see, we couldn't have uh, put that on there anyway because this thing don't have a front linkage. But now, this does actually have a front linkage. But let's see, how do we get to the store? Um, the store is down here somewhere, right there. Let's tag it. So we need to go out this driveway here that we're going towards. So yeah, we need to, you know, turn around and go. I'm just going to leave the, the forks on here for now. Wait, that's a plant. That's a planter right there, isn't it? 
Okay, so we don't have to worry about a planter. So why did that not show? When I went into the garage, why did I not? Oh, it's a, yeah, it's a cedar. Okay. Wow. I didn't. I can't believe I didn't see that. Okay, that's fine. So let's go ahead and shut this off and pick our map up a little bit bigger so we can see what we're doing. We just need to go down this way. Nope, that's not right. Um. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, there's our green beam over there. Okay. Yeah, see, I think when we go to empty this, we got to have the other tube underneath that spot. I know I get sidetracked very easily. I do apologize for that. Uh, it's just me. I'm just kind of weird. Okay, so which way do I need to go? One, okay, so we're going to have to go between the fields, I guess. Because otherwise we need to come all the way up. I got a feeling the baler is going to cost us a pretty penny to rent and then uh, because we're keeping the bales we're not going to make as much money but whatever you know doesn't matter I guess what we could do is we could rent the baler and the, the stacker so that we could uh, stack them but if I'm going to spend money on renting one or leasing, whatever you want to call it. 
I'm going to uh, get enough stuff. But I think what we're going to do is we're going to get the stone, uh, the stone picker back over there. We're going to get the, the cultivator hooked up and we'll get it set up so it's sitting on the field ready to go. And next time we'll cultivate the, the one field. We'll probably do like some of it and then we'll, uh, we'll go over and we'll do a bunch of the, the bales. Then we'll come back and do the rest of the field and then we'll, once we've seen whether we have enough money or not, we'll rent whatever we need and go from there. There's no way, no, see that's, that's just the building over there and that's not ours. No. I do like that about this map that there is a lot of storage as you move around the map. As you find fields, there's plenty of places to store your stuff. Of course, the free tractor wash is nice. Too. Oh, but it's not quite down in the water. But, but we'll get, we'll hopefully get part of that done next time, and most of the other field done. Let's just uh, see. Where do we want to put the? I think the pickup's sitting over here, isn't it? Yeah. So we'll leave this hooked up to the stone picker for now. And like I said, we're going to hook up to the other unit and uh, go from there. All right. We're definitely going to need another tractor. That's uh, kind of a gimme. I mean, some of the big tools we need this thing for, but... Uh, I'm just, I'm looking at this and we've got everything here, you know, we've got all sorts of uh, room to uh, add animals and everything else. I'm sure there's some other spots el elsewhere on the map where we can add buildings that uh, we don't have yet. Does this thing fold up at all? I'm assuming it does. Let's just get this over here and we'll... Uh, Let's see what we can do. I just want to get it, you know, set up so that next time all we got to do is tab over there and start uh, cultivating. And I'm not sure with as big as this thing is, we may be able to do the field all in, you know, in one uh, take. I'm not sure. But we're definitely just going to get this thing sitting. Alright, so that is it for this session. So uh, we'll see you guys in episode 3. Uh, like I said, we're going to do... We're going to cultivate this field. Um, probably plant... I don't know if we're going to plant it right away. Uh, I, I don't really want to put canola back in here. So we may uh, finish off the day. You know, start a new month so we can see what equipment we can get. You know, maybe we can get a baler that's uh, worth it for forty-eight thousand or for a little less than forty-eight thousand. Whatever, we'll see what we can do. Um, remember, uh, if you do like the video, please uh, please hit like, uh, follow, you know, or you know, uh, subscribe, ring the bell if you feel like it. You know, like I said, I'm not going to beg for uh, people to follow, but if you definitely want to, if you like what you see. Definitely feel free to do that. Alright, so I will see you guys next time.